pag-uusapan po natin, ano ba talaga? Meron ba talaga na best time for exercise mm. para sa babae at saka lalaki? Mm -mm. Or kahit anong oras ba, okay mag-exercise? Or may difference ba yung babae at saka lalaki sa oras ng exercise? No? Kasi most of us, syempre, um, well, we always say na morning. Anytime, <laughs> as long as you're able to perform the exercises properly, is the mm -hmm. best time. I actually get asked this question a lot sa clinic. Kunyari, may pasyente magkoconsulta, tapos sasabihin ko, oh, kailangan mo mag-exercise. Ang susunod na tanong yan, anong oras ko po kailangan gawin yung exercise? So, ang palagi ko sinasabi is, as long as hindi mo minamadali. Kasi, mm -hmm. baka naman nga, sinabi ko morning, kaso may trabaho ka. So, syempre, gigising ka ng a little bit extra early mm -hmm. para magawa mo yung exercise. Pero, mamadaliin mo naman siya. E di haphazard mo gagawin yung exercise mo or, or hindi siya yung uh, tamang technique or baka mamaya, imbis na 15 reps na gagawin mo, 10 cut lang short. gagawin mo. Di ba? So, ikakot short mo kasi late ka na. So, ang sinasabi ko, the best time still would be yung kung kailan mo siya magagawa ng properly. Which really makes sense and there's really nothing wrong with that. Pero, meron kasing ginawang pag-aaral sa Amerika na nakita ko yung article nung isang araw. Tapos sabi nila, meron palang tamang oras or hindi tamang oras, better or best time para mag-exercise ka depende sa goal. So, ano yung ibig sabihin nung depende sa goal? Ibig sabihin, ang goal mo ba eh, to feel good? Mm-hmm. To improve your mood, ang goal mo ba e para to lose weight or to gain muscle or to gain strength? Now it depends on babae ka ba o lalaki ka. Interesting. Yes, very interesting. So ano? Lalabas na natin yung kodi ko kasi mahaba ba yung article? Okay. Okay. So yung study ang ginawa nila, kumuha sila ng 30 na babae at saka 26 na lalaki. Actually 15 na babae and 13 na lalaki. Kaya lang may mga dropouts sila. So yung dropouts nila yung hindi nakasunod dun sa regimen or hindi pumasok sa criteria. So ending, they got 30 female and 26 male um middle-aged individuals. Pag sinayo middle-aged individuals, they're age 25 to 55. And then, yung BMI nila, um, para maging, I would say, unbiased, kinuha nila yung normal yung BMI. Kasi syempre, pag medyo malaki yung BMI, mas maraming malulose na weight mm -hmm. yun, eh, di ba? So, so, para matanggal yung bias, ang ginawa lang nila is yung normal yung BMI ng mga individuals. And then, ang ginawa nila is they gave these uh, 56 individuals a uh, 12-week exercise regimen. And then, kalahati dun sa mga babae pinag-exercise ng 6 to 8 in the morning. Tapos kalahati dun sa mga babae, uh, 6.30 to 8.30 ng gabi. Okay. Tapos ganun din sa morning mga lalaki. Shift at morning shift. at after, evening oh. shift. Oh, ganun din yung ginawa nila sa lalaki. Pagkatapos, yung feed yung eating time nila ni regulate then mm -hmm. so yung mga nag exercise ng morning kakain sila ng breakfast an hour after nila mag-exercise and then every 4 hours yung interval so after 4 hours lunch after 4 hours dinner ganon mm -hmm. tapos walang extra meals syempre para control diba mm -hmm. <laughs> mahirap naman para kung pare oo oh, oh. um tas pati diet nila regulated mm -hmm. so meron silang binigay na kung ano lang yung pwedeng kainin at kung gaano lang yung pwedeng kainin para ba uh, unbiased mm -hmm. Tapos ganun din sa lalaki. Ngayon sa gabi naman, kung ikaw ay uh, night shift ang exercise mo, <laughs> you will eat dinner an hour after your exercise okay. and you eat breakfast and lunch four hours before then. No? Mm -hmm. So, kung ang exercise mo ay 6 p.m., four hours before that is your lunch, four hours before that is your breakfast. Ganun din. And then, uh, they were given a set of exercises that they're going to do every day with two days of rest during the week. So, five okay, days of five exercise. Kasi yung protocol nila consists of resistance exercises, endurance exercises, interval yung hit exercises, at saka uh, strength. So, rise. Uh, resistance, interval, strengthening, at saka endurance exercises. Now, the endurance exercises, yun lang yung day na more than one hour yung exercise nila. But the rest of the exercise is less than one hour. And pare-pareho sila ng 
ng set ng exercise na ginagawa. Now, at the end of the 12 weeks, so 12 weeks yun pinagawa, at the end of the 12 weeks, ano ngayon yung kanilang uh, tawag dito na observation. Conclusion. Na observe. Na observe nila. <coughs> so, lahat nung nag-exercise, syempre, nag-improve yung performance and overall health nila. Pero, ah, uh, nagkaiba dun sa kung ano yung na-attain dun sa goal. No? Kasi syempre, obviously, anybody who does exercise, mag improve ka talaga kasi nag-exercise ka. Pero yung goal, dun sila nagkaiba-iba. So, ang nalaman nila is, women should be exercising if your goal is to lose weight. Mm -hmm. Lose yeah. weight. Lose weight. Lose na. weight. Uh, lose weight. Na. Oh, lose weight. <laughs> Morning. Morning. Okay. Ang sad, di ba? Kasi kailangan ko palang gumising yung maaga para mag-lose weight. Morning. Oo. Oh. Oh, oh. So, for women to lose weight, they should be exercising in the morning. Na-find out ba nila yung reason why? Hindi. Hindi, okay. Sige. That's the thing. Kasi kumbaga, maraming uh, factors like posibleng hormones, uh, may uh, genetics. Mm -hmm. So, yun yung well, gusto nilang malaman eventually. Uh, pero for this study, further hindi, onion, further study. Oh, oh, uh, hindi nila nalaman. And also, I think the number of people included in the study is too small uh -oh. para malaman nila yung result, yung, or yung reason behind bakit okay. pag morning lang. No? Pero, to lose weight morning. To lose, lose weight morning. morning. Sa babae. Sa babae. Sa babae. Increase. To then, increase your upper body strength. So, gusto mong medyo palakasin yung arms mo. Morning pa rin. Hindi. Evening. Ah, evening. Ah. <laughs> or women. Kayo. For women. For women. women. Excited, Ang dami pala excited yan. Excited na si Ian. Mamaya. Mamaya ka Ian. Mamaya. Tapos, yung, yung para mapalakas mo yung lower body strength mo, yung thighs, Evening your legs. Evening din yan. Ha? Evening din yan. Morning. Oh, Morning. Iba-iba. Morning. To improve. May tumatawa sa dito. Tumatawa. To improve the overall mood. Ito, alam ko yung morning yan. Morning yan. Evening ako. Evening. Morning. Morning. Tapos, sa lala, hindi, evening. Wala na sila. Ano ba yan? So, evening to improve the mood. Okay, okay. Ulit, ulit, ulit. For women, well. To lose weight. To lose weight. Morning sa babae. Women muna po tayo. Women muna. Women, babae. Uh, to lose weight, umaga. Mm -hmm. Para mapalakas mo yung upper body strength mo, gabi. 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 Para mapalaba mapalabas. <laughs> mapalakas <laughs> mo yung lower body strength mo, morning. morning. Okay. Para ma-improve yung mood mo, evening. Oh. Morning oh. and evening na lang. No? Para, para. Bukara ko na lang mag-exercise. <laughs> Tapos, si Ian naman. Sa lalaki naman, wala. Medyo ko. Wala. <laughs> Hindi na ganoon. Wala. 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 <laughs> Anytime. Hindi. Sa lalaki, it doesn't matter what time of day yung weight loss. Ang daya. Ay, talaga do? Talaga. Anytime. It doesn't matter sa lalaki. Anytime. Pero, ang ano nila. Complicated. Ah, sana ba? Talaga. Hmm. Anytime. Yung, yung upper, yung, um, ito. Cool ah. Cool. Anytime. Para. Bakit na wala yung sa men? Wala, wala yung men. Hindi <laughs> totoo. Eh di kahit doc, ano, no? Manari, kagigising mo lang or bago ako matulog, anytime talaga siya. Actually, Actually oh, oh, mas maganda. Um, ano yung goal mo? No? Uh, depending on your goal. Ayun, sa lalaki, para ma-improve yung mood nila, evening din. Evening. Ah, wow. evening. Kayo, no? And then yung kanilang... Per body. Alam mo, wala talaga sa men, no? Ah, eto. <laughs> In the men cohort, evening increased fat ox. Ayon pala, fat oxidation and reduced BP and fatigue evening. Ayon. Meron pala evening. So kung gusto makalus ng ng weight ng lalaki sa gabi, evening. To improve yung kanilang overall health, like yung blood pressure, sugar control, evening then. Kapi pa. Pero wal ang wala pa lang difference yung upper body strength or yung lower body strength. Sa, sa men. Ah, okay. Sa women lang may difference yung ganun. Tapos yung, yung sa mood sa gabi. Sa lalaki. So yun yung interesting things na nakita nila doon. So yung sa women, um, import, I think it's very important that we take this into consideration kasi important na malus. Yung, yung tinitignan kasi nila yung fat loss sa abdomen. Mm -mm. Which is quite important kasi Nandun yung internal organs yeah. natin eh. So, if you have a trimmer or I would say a smaller belly, ibig sabihin nun, smaller yung belly fat mo, konti lang yung fat na nag, uh, 
ang tawag doon, pumapalibot sa internal organs natin. So, yung mga may fatty liver, ganyan, Correct. yung mga uh, may extra fat inside, mm -hmm. that is actually encroaching on your internal organs. Nababawasan. Okay. So, I think ito yung, I would say, take away doon sa study na to, na if you really want to improve, I would say, overall health, I think better for women to exercise in the morning.